Hello, Gemini. Welcome to your coffee cup reading, July 1st. And this is a quick, general, and intuitive reading. All right, so let's take a look here. Gemini, there's a lot of energy around you this week. I want to say a lot to do with love and matters of the heart, okay, for some of you. So definitely, and these could be some important decisions that you have to make with love. Um, for what, what I see, not everybody is going to be happy with either your relationship or there's some jealousy or you're uncomfortable with it. So something is there. Um, so I do see that for some of you. Okay. All right. You could be very defensive this week. This is people, situations, um, things like that could be leaving your life. There could be some arguments, disputes. Um, not everyone's on the same page here too, but you but you can win the battle. But then again, you may feel some kind of a loss for some reason. It's like kind of you win, but you lose. Either there's a weird feeling about it. I don't know. I'm seeing something like that too. So I do see that energy. Uh, you're definitely taking back your power this week. For some of you, definitely feeling lonely and very empty inside about some situation here, too. This is why you could be a little frustrated or on the edge, all right? And I do feel that this is like with your commitments, love relationships. For some of you, if you're in a relationship, too, this could be feeling just a little lonely. You're a little bit disconnected and frustrated, okay? So I do see that kind of energy uh, showing up as well. All right, for others of you, too, this could be with work. There could be some edginess and frustrations with co-workers or people that you work with. All right, so I do feel that, too. Pick and choose your battles, I want to say, this week, too. Okay, so I do feel that. And it's a temporary thing. This is like a passing phase here. All right, so I'm seeing that, too. It is a good week for um, contracts and maybe negotiations, so I do see that energy and for some of you, your mother is in focus, okay? Your mother may, because of your mother, for some of you, or a mother figure in your life, you may be kind of like uh, indecisive about something too. And it could be connected to love. So I do feel that energy too. I do feel for some of you with work too, this is um, like a contract job coming up too and something that you're going to be happy about. But or you may decline something too. Maybe it's not to your expectations. So I do feel that energy as well. For some of you, if you're waiting for some kind of either contract job or some uh, something like that, you may have to wait uh, maybe another like 14, 15 days, something like that to a couple weeks. So I do feel that energy. For some of you, this is also you signing or agreeing to something. This could be a legal contract document or something like that. For some of you, these could be like prenuptial agreements, okay? So that is showing up for some. I do see some of you are going to have to say no to someone or something this week too. So no um, is showing up too. Now, someone has a question um, that I'm seeing too. It's the answer is no. Okay, so seeing that energy too. All right, I do see somebody could be watching you a little bit too closely here. This could be maybe management for work and then they're kind of looking at what you're doing. So I do see that energy as well, but it looks positive. Maybe they're um, inspired or they like what you are giving out to the company or something that you're doing. So I do feel that some of you, this is some like a coworker that has their eye on you. It could be a love interest, too, so I do feel that. Your words have power this week, so what you do say is going to stick for good or for bad. All right, new ideas are coming through, too, and I do feel that they, these could be some plans for summer or for the next season. I don't know. I'm seeing that maybe going into, I don't know. These could be vacations, so I see that kind of energy, new ideas coming through, too. I wouldn't make any quick decisions this week, either. You could have some words with, like, earth sign energies. They could be problematic this week, um, too. I do see the energy of a Capricorn and a Taurus here, as well, coming into play, so I do feel that. Um, there is also, no matter what, I do see victory and success this week, too. So that's looking good. You are coming up to a very strong healing phase here, too, and feeling more 
um, in comfortable. I want to say the word comfortable keeps coming up for me too. But you do have some big major changes that are coming in as well. I do see seeing the reality in a situation is showing up too. And you could be visualizing some things for the future. This could be also your imagination, daydreaming. So seeing that kind of energy too. So no matter what, I do see you, um, you know, coming out smelling like a rose with something as well. So victory and success. New groups of people are coming in too. This could be a new social group. This could be people that kind of had were weary about you and now they're kind of like um, more on Team Gemini, okay, so to speak. So yeah, social energy is also showing up. All right, Gemini, that is your reading for the week of July 1st. I hope you have a fabulous week and bye for now.